<laughs> Hello, Niblingo, little Nibbling. What is it, Sheldon? I was hoping I could try to calm your baby down. Why? I'm trying new things to build up a tolerance for setbacks and frustration. So you want to use my child for some kind of experiment? Yes. Okay, here you go. Soft kitty, warm kitty, little ball of fur. Happy kitty, sleepy kitty, purr, purr, purr. Are you freaking kidding me? I'm not happy about it either. Hey. Hi. What are you doing here? Where's the baby? She's fine. She's with Connie. I just needed a couple of minutes. Which was a couple hours ago. Well, I'll go check on her. Unless you want to. Actually, I don't know what I want. What does that mean? My daughter hates me. What difference does it make if I'm there or not? You know that ain't true. Really? Because all she does is cry, and I'm tired all the time, and even your brother is better at soothing her than I am. You're just a little overwhelmed. It's normal. Why aren't you? Well, we can't both be freaked out at the same time. We gotta take turns. When's your turn? I already had it. I was so scared when I got to the hospital, I'd, I got back in my car and drove away. Well, I was in labor. Don't hit me. We're sharing freakouts. And I still came back. What kind of parents are we? The new kind. The well-meaning dumb kind. We're gonna get better, right? We ain't got no choice. <laughs> I'll let you sleep. I'm gonna go check on Cecily. Thank you. What are you smiling at? Just thinking. We might have conceived Cece in this very garage. Okay, you're gross. Leave now. Bye. <sighs> Dealing with failure is a tricky business. You can face it head on and try to overcome it. Good job, Mama. You can avoid it. Thanks for letting me stay for as long as you need. You can try to drown it out. Or you can try to talk to someone about it. And some people choose to run.